Oh. Oh my goodness, where am I? Huh? What is this? A hat? Mr. Midnight? Oh no, your head, kitty. Wait just a second, this is not my kitty. What a weird hat. Anyways, I have to find Kitty. I hope you're here somewhere. Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Fran Bo. So, in the last episode, it was really short. We needed to finish up what we were doing. I wasn't feeling the greatest. I kind of just wanted to go down for the day. So now it's two days later and I'm recording again with Miss Cassie over here. What's up, sluts? And we're playing through Fran Bo. Or at least I'm I playing love through how and these she's people, judging me. These people just have a framed picture of a teapot on the wall? These people also have a framed picture of what seems to be a Siamese twin carrying Mr. Midnight. Do they really expect you to drink a bowl of blood? It's uh, not blood, it's red milk. I won't lay down in that thing. Yeah. Alright, alright, game. Welcome By the home, way. beautiful kitten. We hope you like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love, Clara and Mia. Clara. Um, Clara and Mia. Also, you're gonna need to click a lot. Oh, you don't say. It's a point-and-click well, adventure game. I know, but what I'm saying is there's a lot of stuff to collect in here, but I don't want to tell you exactly what. That's fine. I'd rather do it myself. Are those eyes? Ugh. Maybe they like to see things, so they need more eyes. I have my pills. They make me see a lot of weird things. Yeah, pi some pills do that, you know. Sounds like you're overdosing, and you need to go to rehab, sweetheart. Mmm, a head from a human, I guess. Skulls always look so happy. Maybe they haven't realized they're dead yet. All right. This child. She's very interesting. A cooker and a cook. My mommy told me how to a use cooker. this. A cooker. I don't like to light matches though. It always feels like it could burn my entire face. This is 1944 like, or something. So, just yeah. as a heads up, that's why they have to use matches. Firewood to keep the chimney warm. Poor trees. I wonder if they scream all the time while they're burning. Okay. Um. Why is this part painted black and white? Maybe they didn't have enough paint I like to paint everything. Tiling. So I guess every everyone has different styles and tastes. <laughs> uh, hey, Juliet! Cut the crap! You're a puppy! You're not a bark fox! Shush! Mr. Midnight, these girls, they took my kitty. I don't like to be selfish, but that's my kitten. I like their blue dresses, though. What's with this game in blue dresses? Those blue dresses are great. Why are you judging, mister? A blue? painting of a teapot with painted tea inside with lemon and honey. A paint... Okay, that was just two things, then. That's weird. Um... This has a bow. Oh, a sharp... A sharpie shiny knife. It can be good to have... It'll be good to have you. To dry my little hands. I don't have soup. I don't need a spoon. <laughs> Okay. What? Because there's no use for a spoon beyond soup. Spatula. It sounds like Dracula, but in a spa. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm, Why yummy. Why does this 10-year-old child know about flavors. Dracula? I knew about Dracula when I was, like, four. I don't think I did. Honeyberry, you taste fabulous. Um... Flower makes me sneeze, but that's a funny feeling. Dead rose... King Leo's baking soda. This always makes the biggest cupcakes. A pine cone. I don't dare to touch it. Maybe it'll attack me. Yeah, to be fair, we She's were... She's traumatized to pine cones now. I yep. think this is great. We gave her pine cone PSTD. PTSD. Shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. I close the window so the cold wind stays out. I open the window so the cold wind comes in. And stays out. So I'm gonna take my pills now. Is that fine? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, that's enough of that. <laughs> I ain't having what? none of that. So. I guess I should probably explore that area. Oh, I see you have it comfortable there, little baby. You seem fresh. Are you still alive? You're a clever little baby. You took your pl your placenta with you. 
This placenta is like a jetpack of blood and nutrients. What? Did your mommy drop you? I bet she did it because she was sick. It's not your fault. Oh, I see you have it comfortable there, little baby. Hello, little baby. What are you doing here? Nobody loves you, but you're so pretty. I like you. At least you're on the wall like a picture so everyone can see you. A secret bottle with a secret inside. I'm very curious right now. What could it be? I don't have anything for that yet. So this is the bottom of the well, but this is the real world version of it. Or the not quite so real world from the looks of it. I have matches to light up the darkness or just for fun. Sounds like Fran's gonna become a pyromaniac. Just like the one girl from Don't Starve. They don't smell, they must be plastic flowers then. Okay, yeah, no, it's a waste of water. This looks like a plant. Oh, uh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Sorry, that took me a second. Uh, everyone likes salt. A very good ingredient. It smells like weed, but we have like a weed we have in our garden. This is a really weed every day. By the way, these fuckers have pictures of meat on the wall. Yeah. What? They had teapots and they had a picture of a Siamese twin carrying Mid Mr. Midnight. One odd little thing, it looks like a seed. I, I wonder who Mush is, is because he owns all it. the mushrooms. <laughs> what a pretty can. I won't take someone else's food, not all of it anyway. Pepper, always good to dress up the soup. If there's garlic here, there are no vampires. If okay, Kitty likes to play with olives. I guess he thinks they're insects. Squirrels' body parts? I don't want to know. I think those are nuts. Mm -hmm. You dumb, dumb girl. Oh, squirrel nut. Oh, Fran? <laughs> That's inappropriate. The bag smells funny. I I won't touch it. Okay. Um. The window is locked. Great. Is that Pooh Bear? Oh, a dancing teddy. He doesn't have shoes. But it does have a tie. That makes Teddy happy. Okay, just two things. Alright, let's go uh, light up this world like nobody else. Okay. First things first. On there. Why does it matter? Okay. No. Those... Um, if you don't know what you're supposed to do yet, I suggest you just get the stuff and then move on. Don't actually try to do anything besides that yet. Okay. Take some pills! What? I'm, I have some confusion. Oh, I like the Titty! picture. Oh, I didn't even... Oh. Um... I don't have any shots to drink. I never saw a rose in the ocean. Maybe it's an old story. Maybe the moon gave her the rose because he loves her. So I really like She's that picture. I love those things. With the moon. Sokka? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. <laughs> Sokka. Everyone Sokka. loves Sokka! What a tiny house in the middle of nowhere. Uh, I want to go to Kame House. Gabe, I'm going to give you a little, just like, a little spoiler. That's where you are. That house. That's yeah, I, I was I was trying not to. Cassie? It's obviously this house. Why would they have a framed picture of another house? Because I was saying it was Kame House because I didn't want to just. But I'm not sure. Could it be? Yeah, so that's uh, the mom and aunt, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um... A vase to put some flowers in it. it has ashes inside. I don't think that's for flowers then. In that is that a flying pig? Now I understand what the deer wanted back in the hospital. 
Eat some of the food. That food looks good as fuck, yo. It didn't want to get its head fixed. It wanted its head on the wall. Silly me. Firewood in a line to be burnt. Chocolate cake, my favorite. Should I? Maybe just a little. Mmm, delicious. Okay. This cake looks absolutely yummy. I could eat the whole thing. Delicious. Beautiful. My mouth's melting. I'm so hungry. No one noticed notice one little cupcake. No, this is Alice in Wonder. No, don't do it. Yeah. <sighs> well, I got an achievement. Uh, let's see what that achievement was. Cake and sweet craving. This is not my cup. Just like that cake wasn't your cake and that cupcake the wasn't The teapot has no tea at all. So this is just Alice in Wonderland. Is that what I'm getting? Mmm, caramel sauce all over it. Sweet candy. Wait, no. What's up? Go to love first. No, oh, I didn't even notice that. All right, <laughs> so back upstairs. <laughs> oh, she's gone. Damn. Oh my goodness, the smell! Poor girl, who could have done this and why? This is your mommy, dingus. I need to be careful and protect my kitty and myself. Jam. Does, uh, does that look familiar? Yeah, of course I was familiar. The blueberry... Aha. Uh -huh. It could be him, only a bit younger. Yeah, the yeah. aunt we saw earlier is a famous jazz player. Oh, a world. record player. I wonder if it works. Let's see. Oh, let's go. Oh, it's Hi, Owl. Owls Alice and cats are a bit alike. Both are curious, both like to kill mice, and both are good companions of witches. You really shouldn't have said that. There are many books and things on the shelf. So many things that makes me dizzy. I'll just leave it here. Oh, a typewriter, and it works. I guess I could write, but there's no paper. And a good writer has to know what, what to write about first. I've never actually seen anyone play music on that fucking recorder. <laughs> I didn't know we could. Oh. Well, aren't I the best? Many tiny paintings, and there's a cat. When I grow up, I'll have a lot of cat paintings on my wall, and other things too, She's but I'm not grown up cat yet. Lady. Or, you know, a witch. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this entire place is under the wall. It's just at the bottom. The stairs end up in a wall. Maybe that was the, maybe that was the door I made, and now it disappeared. I'll have to find another way out. All right, that makes sense. A monster who likes goats. <clears throat> Chupacabra? The goat looks angry. I guess he's ticklish or annoyed. That chandelier is really pretty and it's pink. And broom to fly away or just clean around. So yeah, she's definitely a witch. The drawer opened. Let me see what's inside. Black candles to light up the darkness. Okay, this is seeing more and more like a witch. The sisters, they look alike. Pink and blue, complete opposites. Going okay. to that room, cube. So that's definitely the moment, Aunt. Red rose in a painting, huh? Go to the room. <sighs> a mirror, but why is my reflection not there? Hello, huh? The mirror doesn't do its job. It's a little keyhole. Maybe it's just decor. <laughs> it's, that, it's that monster and so much blood. I guess I'm not the only one who can see him then. Is he holding a head? I have to be careful. That's the first time you're worried about someone carrying a head? Someone was carrying your head. <laughs> White candles everywhere. This book, this looks like a very old painting. A mommy holding two babies. I wonder. So, I can't tell, is she twins then? Or does it have to do with, maybe it's a hereditary thing where there's twins or maybe that's symbolism? I'm not sure yet. I'm figuring it out. You'll see. Mm, the perfume smells like teenagers. Nice stuff. Very girly. I guess I'll be very girly when I grow up. Okay. You missed something over there. Uh, these toys are so ugly. I hope they didn't hear me. 
I don't want them to try to catch me and kill me. I thought you could take these, but... Oh, I guess I was missing. Hello, doll. Who caught you? I hope this never happens to me. I guess it doesn't make me happy. It doesn't need to happen if I'm clever enough. I'll lay down to sleep tight when I get back home. Aunt Grace has uh, for sure put some new sheets. What? I love the feeling of my sleepy head on a clean pillow. A lot of people think Fran might be British, and that's why she talks the way she does. Uh, it would make I sense for her to call it like a cooker and whatever, because I think British people call them cookers sometimes. Or you know, she's just weird and reads a lot of books, and that's why she that's why she talks the way she does. Because. I know, but the name. Hi. Need some of these. Okay, I need to test that. It yeah, I didn't pretty. want to tell you. I wanted you to realize that every room in the house leads to the well. I could have told you in the first room, but I was like, nah, I'm gonna let him wait it out. See how many rooms it takes him. I want to see how it reacts in every room, though. Every single room just leads back to the well. Okay. Um, how am I gonna get that? What items do I have currently? I have the broom for flying. Tweezers. No. Okay. I wanna be sure. Maybe the broom here? There we go. Ah, come on. That, is, that never works, by the way. That literally huh. always happens if you use the broom. Bad though. piece of broom. Bad, bad. I don't actually know what you're supposed to do with that broom, because everybody does that with it. It just breaks. And then it's like, what? Was I supposed to use it for something else? I don't know. Wait. I wish I could pick it back up. Oh, well, I'll figure it out in a moment. Oh, wait. There's one wait. room you didn't explore, Gabe. Yeah, I know. I want to see if I could grow the plant. What are you doing? Whatever I want. I'm searching the room, seeing if I missed anything. I would tell you if you missed anything. Well, I, I want to be sure. You don't know everything. That's Can I thing. interact with this? You don't. I've done multiple things that you didn't know about. That's what you think. It was all a ruse. You thought I didn't know, but it was ideal all along. Is ideal? Oh, a ladder. Perhaps Mr. Midnight's up there. She could not reach that. There's a light right above you, friend. Foxy, no! Foxy, no! Why would she so get you out of here? in this game. This game hates you, personally. What is their problem, poor Foxy Fox? Hope someday I find a fox that isn't dead so I can talk with it. I agree. What a pretty doll. I like the hairstyle. Why are you still sitting there? There's so many dolls to play with. But I wouldn't play with any of them. They look scary. I have to agree with her. Just one hat. Okay. Oh, let me see. The sisters. They have the same jacket that I had in the hospital. But if they're sisters, why are they so old? Sisters can't be old? That's a big umbrella. A dusty mirror and some other things. I won't put my hands inside the box. There must be like a thousand spiders in there. Good, good friend. Smart the toys friend. in the attic always carry sadness within them. It's very understandable. I wouldn't like to be abandoned in the attic. Mr. Rat, it's time to get up. I met another rat a while ago. Mr. Rat, are you tired, sir? Huh? It's weird how sometimes she knows something's dead, but then others she doesn't. She mm, a lot of tiny dead. stuff. Is that an angel's head? Weird stuff you can find in an attic. I think the thing is that anything that could have been killed by Mr. Midnight, she seems to know is dead, but anything that couldn't have been, she doesn't seem to realize it. But that or rat could have reverse. easily been killed. No, by I mean her. reverse that. But she knew those, um... <laughs> So I just want to point out it's Gemini, the twins. Oh, hello, little babies. Who sewed you together? 
It looks like it hurts. Don't cry, all right? You can smile and be nice. It's time to sleep. I'll turn it down in editing. A bunny doll, are you waiting for Easter? Do you lay eggs or do you steal them from a chicken? And how do eggs become chocolate eggs? Mr. Minette, are you here, kitty? But I Meow. think in, in one of the earlier things, she knew some a uh, person was dead. Okay. It's you, oh my goodness, my beloved friend, I found you. Friend, is that really you? Oh dear, finally. So do you think this is really midnight? No. Surprise, bitch. Oh, Fran, I'm so happy to see you. I missed you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you, too, Mr. Midnight, and I really missed you. Oh, dear friend, how do you find this place? After the people took you away in the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost. My senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something bit and something happened. Something someone told me. I don't know. Okay. Oh, my dear, I'll open the cage. We need to get to Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was just a bad dream. I'm tired too, but at least we can take care of each other. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure. Mr. Knight, what is it? Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. Really? What kind of presence? For what I felt, it wasn't human, but it was really peaceful and kind. Which? That's the real magic. Great to have somebody else taking care of us. Fran, did you hear that? Did you? Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try to find the key to unlock you, alright? I love you. So this next um, thing we're going to do, we have to do it in a certain sequence. Good night. I don't know if you had to turn that light off. I didn't. Okay, so... we got to find the key to get Mr. Midnight out. Uh, you said a certain sequence, so tell me if I'm about to do something wrong, alright? Don't tell me what to do, just tell me if I'm going to do something wrong. Oh, you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. This is the secret I'm talking about. There you are. We were waiting for you. Where's your head? My head? This part doesn't matter. Okay. Just you want. My head is just in the right place. You, the precious being from the other world. Who would ever believe us? I'm confused. I'm very confused right now, ladies. What are you talking about? Fran Bell, that's your name, right? And your mom and dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? How do you know? Slow down. How is that you know all this? We just know. We have to. We are a part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us all the time. I feel oh, lost. So good. So it's good. not a problem if I say this? Nope. Say it if you want. I wish nothing bad happened to me. I feel completely lost. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. They won't come back. I should do that, but Mommy and Daddy will never come back. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It'll make you feel better. Who told you about me? Thank you, but really, I need to know who told you these things about me. Are you scared, little Fran? I'm confused. Of course not, I'm just curious, that's all. I'm mostly confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in the world. And yet, you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Should it be us trembling in fear of you? I love him. This is also... doesn't matter. And that is why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? Okay, this is where it starts to matter. Okay. Be as nice as possible. He's my best friend. Yes, please. I really wish to have him back. He's my best friend. 
Before we set him free, tell us about how it is you, that you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place. A very ugly place. They opened the heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. Phil told me a secret, and I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came into the woods and met a giant ant. And I killed a bug, and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. And then I made a door, and that door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't really remember anything else. Ah, and I saw really a real pinecone family. This is before I came here. They live in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. Ah, and I, f I saw flying insects that got stuck in a tree because they have long hair. That all was also in the woods, but now here I am. Looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I'm ten. I'm ten years old, but I have to turn eleven soon. Are you and you? We're seventeen years old, much older than you, so 16, you have to obey us. Oh, I, I sorry, I thought they were dancing queens. No. Uh they got this house for their super sweet sixteen. <sighs> okay, um Uh those are not open nice. The cage. I just wish you would open the cage so I can go home with my kitty. You haven't even asked her names, so that's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around our house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all? Nice. I'm stop that, please. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? Whatever you need. Yes, ladies, I'll do whatever you need. Good, now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical? I don't know. They won't know who Annie is, so that's why I wouldn't go with that one. But. Magic is magical. Who doesn't like magic? Anyway, this magic is very powerful. It's tremendous and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be cautious and precise, otherwise terrible things can happen. Summon the old lost... Body. Yeah, I know. I just couldn't read the rest of it. Don't know if I can. If I'm going to be able to. Don't do so. We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. Not born like this? One night a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it was not. He decided that we should spend an eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back, but we will do it later when we are not attached to each other anymore, and show him what that he is powerless. Blah, and show him that he is powerless, and he will regret it. I'll try my best. We're going to f gather some things that you need for the ritual. In the meantime, you can go and talk to your cat, but we won't set him free yet. Don't even try to open the cage. If you help us, we will help him. Thank you. I'll go and talk to him. If you were, hey, um... God damn it, girls. Finish. Do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you, you silly, silly girl? <laughs> Listen to this fucking music. It's so good. Anyway, there's a character coming up that I'm going to voice. Also, if you're rude to the girls, they don't let you talk to Mr. Midnight while they're busy. They lock him up there. So. That's why I wanted you to be a nice folks again. And that's why you don't need to turn the light off, because if you do it right, you can come back up here. Oh, Fran, did you get the key already? Not yet, my dear. I'm sorry, those girls are scary. They just want to utilize me. They cut my hair from me and took some blood. That's awful. I think it's for the recipe. I think they're witches. Wicked witches. You know, like in the stories we like to read. Yes, you're absolutely right. I don't know what to do. I don't know, Fran, but what did those girls tell you? They told me they weren't attached to each other before, and that they would get revenge against the one who did this to them. And they also showed me a key. I'm pretty sure it's for this cage. They have the evil inside. I mean, maybe that somebody had its reasons. Um... I guess we have to fight evil with evil. There must be something, something that they are really afraid of. I don't know, I'll see if, what I can find. See you soon, my friend. At least I 
shut the fuck up now. God you had to open your mouth. You open your mouth. Those shoes are too big for me. A scorpion. Scorpions make me nervous. They walk with their butts in the air ready to stab you. Maybe it's a zodiac thing. I'm a Sagittarius. <gasps> Ryan, what's Mr. Rats. A bunch of records. I'm not in the mood for happy music, I guess. There's nothing else up here. I was just reading everything that I didn't read yet. Um, so that key could either work for that cage or for this. We'll see. Yeah, this is disturbing. I love how they didn't even take care of the body. They just leave it there, like, right next to the table with all their food in it. Yep. Hi! It's him again, but I haven't taken my pills. Well, he opened the window. Thank you, but who is he? He's the angel. A rusty old bicycle. Bicycle. Bicycle in the middle bicycle. of. Bicycle. Yeah, bicycle. I don't think it would take me very far. There's nothing but water around this house. Hey, you. Hey, hey, hey. I said I was gonna read him. Yes, who's speaking? I didn't realize. I thought that was Fran. Me, I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. Yes? What is it? You are in great danger. Don't trust those girls. Why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad, and I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me. Every time I try to get out of here, I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad and a cat magnet. They love us, but not to give us love. Just to use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty's here, then. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic, right? Yeah, they did. Did you see the dead girl in one of the rooms? Oh, no, I took completely missed that. Well, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried. She did it wrong. But what should I do then? I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I'd be creative. Huh, creative. I'll try to do my best. And girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. I got a family. Today was... Today was like... Special dinner night. Um... Hi. My sister is trying to catch me, but I ran away. I'm scared. Would you help me? I have a monster inside my head. Okay. So what does it say on the wall there, Gabe? Doubters need the truth on paper. The problem is we don't have paper, and that's why we need a typewriter to type something else. Is there anything around this area that looks slightly out of place? Even slightly. Are you kidding me? Everything. Like the moon! Moonlight on the water. You're so beautiful and calm. I always feel like the moon is following me. I wonder if the moonlight does the same job as the sunlight. A big, okay. big rock. I'll leave it right there. I... Okay. Click everything in this area. Like, I am. Everything. I'm... Pink I roses. Know. Ow, I pricked my finger. Bad roses. Is it in the dark world, or can I turn this off? It's in both, but you can turn this off if you want. Good. Sorry, it's a bit annoying. Um. What? It's not even out of place. This is annoying. It fits in almost perfectly. There Board. you go. Good yeah, job, I got babe. it. A long woody plank. I could do something with it. Yeah, I got people it. People miss that a lot because it looks like it's supposed to be there. No, it is supposed to be that? there. Okay. I'm not stupid. But what I mean is that it looks like it's not... You can't pick it up. It looks like it's yeah, I, I figured, and that's why I checked it. I didn't want to exactly say it, but... Yeah! Fucking see what's in this bottle. Yeah, boy. Let's go. I can't lift it. It's too heavy for me. Wait a second. There might be an achievement if you don't do that. 
try using the matches instead. Okay. Yeah! I burn you! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> burn you, rope! Haha, <laughs> you're welcome. Everybody uses the knife, so I figured you could walk back down, you know. What the? Oh. Ah, that burned. Why? There is no fire. There just was fire. I can't touch the bottle. It really burns. Why would but you use candles? <laughs> I want to see if I can light the candles. This is the only thing I can... There we go. Oh, I got the paper. This is so exciting. Revealing the true soul. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. To Can destroy an... Fine. Yeah. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need blood from the executor of the ritual. Executor. Five black candles. Executor. Sorry. Ashes to form a pentagram, a blue-bloomed moonlight rose, salt and pepper, hair from the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lighted black candle on every point of the pentagram, fill a cauldron with water, and put the other elements in it. Boil. Pour over the person you want to bewitch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Bonter ir ekan o ir bagama. Oh, a beer na maybe I'm not going to read the rest of this because I could have to read it later. Um, so I have three of the five ingredients, is that right? Yeah. No, three of the six. You can get the number one super easily. What from the executor of the ritual. I wonder how to do that. I want to see if I can just do it via this. No. I love how it's just blood drops in your inventory. <laughs> how does that even work? Okay. You can um, go put all that in the um a thing blue if you want. Moonlight rose. Go outside. Uh, what, is, what does it sound like you have to do for that? I need a blue bloomed moonlight rose. So I need a rose. I thought I'd cut off a rose roses. and throw it in there. So I need... What do you have in your inventory? That's weird. Salt, pepper, vase... That? Nope. Baking soda... I don't know. Maybe the thing I need to that read you this. said was a seed. Lost in darkness, lost in tears, your body becomes alive through the hand of one angel that decides to bring you sorrow. You'll need the heart of a frog, the head of a young virgin, hair and blood from a black pet, a pentagram made of ashes, the burnt body of a fox. I wonder how many of those they already have. Oh, this is a really nice blue rose. The best rose. So, Except for the one that hung out scary. with the 9th and 10th doctors. Alright, so go put everything in the pot. I'm not done yet, though. I don't have the hair from the people you want to bewitch. Fine. Do you know what you have to do to get it? Because it doesn't say that the, it needs hair or the other recipe, which is the one they'll go with. I know what you have to do. Give me a minute. I'm gonna. It takes people some time to figure out what to do. Okay. Do they have a brush anywhere? This is what people usually think they have to do. Okay. Well, you cannot tell me that because that means I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> I'm not telling you you're doing it wrong, though. I'm just saying that's usually what other people think they have to do. Don't. Do you guys have hair? No. Okay. Why? I want to see if they have hair. I'm just searching They're around. They're bald-ass babies. Mm 
Like, could y'all clean that up? That's really starting to smell. Yeah, it's not exactly pleasant. By the way, Gabe, look at that painting now. The one with the girl in it. Yeah. Oh, okay. What? That was your hint that you were supposed to put the rose into the yeah, water. I, yeah, I figured. Yeah. Most people don't actually look at the painting, so they don't know. Um... Where can I get hair from? How can I get hair? Hmm... This is an intriguing one. You know what's even more intriguing? What? The fact that we're gonna see them NEXT TIME on Let's Play Fran Bo! Fucking bullshit. <laughs> So next time, we're gonna be moving on. We're gonna be trying to get this spell working and try to stop those girls from using us as a sacrifice to get their greedy revenge. I don't think they're See gonna you eat then. It. Why would they use us as a sacrifice, though? We're the one that has to do the ritual for them. The last time they had... You know what, never mind. They don't know if we're a virgin. We could be a hoe. You don't know our life. 